13 Action News Update, sponsored by Silver State Schools Credit Union. Hello, I'm Dave Cravassier, and right now on your 13 Action News Update, two men were hurt after a shooting this morning near Bonanza and Nellis. Las Vegas Metro Police say they found a man with a gunshot wound in the parking lot of a car wash. Officers then got a call of another man with a gunshot wound nearby. Investigators say the second man was shot at the car wash. Right now, the extent of the men's injuries is not known, and police have no suspects in custody. Governor Sisolak says Nevada will distribute COVID-19 vaccines in tiers. 173,000 Nevadans who are at the highest risk of being exposed to COVID-19 will get the first batch. Sisolak adds that number includes healthcare workers, law enforcement officers, those living in nursing homes, and will likely have to wait until spring for mass distribution to the general public. City of Henderson's kicking off their annual Winterfest. Tonight there will be a virtual tree lighting ceremony. The event will be streamed live on the City of Henderson's Facebook page at 5.15 p.m. This year's Winterfest will also feature a virtual gingerbread house competition, an art showcase, and a virtual Santa meetup. It's a cold time of year here in early December with these short days, the sun setting technically before 4.30 in the afternoon and our afternoon temperatures not really climbing all that much. We're talking highs in the mid 50s in Las Vegas, upper 50s in Pahrump and Mesquite. And that sunshine means a clear sky is on the way this evening and that promises a quick drop to 44 by 8 p.m., 39 by midnight, and that sets the stage for another very cold night. We'll all fall down to the low in the mid 30s by daybreak Friday, 59 Friday afternoon. Upper 30s again Saturday and Sunday, so chilly in the weekend mornings, Dave, but we're back in the low 60s this weekend. All right, Justin, that was your 13 Action News Update. You can find more on our website, ktnv.com, and our free mobile app.